Who are contingent faculty? They are graduate students, college professors, and adjunct instructors who do not have tenure and are in positions that will never enable them to have it. They have little economic stability or job security since their contracts are usually year to year or semester by semester. The American Association of University Professors has found that the proportion of part and full-time faculty members in contingent positions has dramatically increased from 43% in 1975 to 68% in 2008. Though it varies widely by type of institution, today 69.4% of the academic labor force is contingent. According to new faculty majority, women make up between 51% and 61% of adjunct faculty. According to Inside Higher Education, faculty of color are also overrepresented in contingent positions. The AAUP Faculty Compensation Survey describes contingent faculty pay as appallingly low, ranging from an average of just under $2,300 per course at public two-year colleges to just over $4,600 at private PhD granting institutions. According to Inside Higher Ed, nearly 25% of adjunct faculty members have to rely on public assistance. And according to the American Federation of Teachers, 40% struggle to cover basic household expenses. Although many contingents are considered part-time, their actual workload is often closer to or exceeds full-time since they have to teach at multiple institutions to make ends meet. Even worse, only 30% of reporting institutions contribute to retirement plans for some or all of their part-timers, and only 37% help with premiums for health insurance plans. Too many parts of the American economy rely on relatively underpaid, vulnerable classes of workers. Academia is one of them. 